continuing with the Greek theme over here, we're going to talk about some of the Greek comedies and tragedies, plays. Um, and hard to read the plays, easier to watch, obviously, because when you're reading it, a lot of the action happens in the long-winded talking. Um, of course, a lot of people think those are the boring parts to read, but that's where a lot of the action is in the plays, is the monologues. So, Antigone was a was an interesting one. Uh, actually, talked about it in a class, and really shed a little bit of light into actually how to say Antigone and not Antigone, but. Uh, I did learn about the, the action really happening in the, the long monologues and the, because in, in high school, when we had to read it, the, the teachers weren't as good with it. It was just something we had to read and they would go through it. But in, in college, they, the professor obviously cared a little bit more uh, and was able to break it down and the story behind it was okay it's just more fascinating understanding more of when the action is occurring um, I think a lot of people could agree it was kind of a little bit drier, but one that most people were made to read. So, for all those that struggle through it, just know you're not the only one. And if you enjoyed it, let me know what your favorite part was.